right guys, so today the weather got nice for once. So we're back offshore looking for grouper and hogfish. So far, we're hoping the weather stays nice. I feel the wind picking up right now, but we should be all right. So today we're just fishing 40 to 50 feet. We might end up bouncing out to 70, 80 feet. It all depends. Uh, I got my buddy Kevin with me today. He's the grunt master. <laughs> Actually, he's got more hogs than any of us. <laughs> <laughs> Brandon was actually supposed to not be able to fish today, but plans changed, so we're back at the grind like normal. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Kevin's first hogfish, boys. Stick your finger in his gill on the backside like this. Quick measure. That's a keeper. She just makes her. Nice. All right, guys. So this is our setup here. The shrimp is always on a circle hook with three beads and a sinker, just dropping it down and getting the grunts fired up. Kevin just caught a nice male hogfish. Let's see if we can pull a couple more here. No, it's a hog, boys. Mr. Pinfish, you're gonna get turned into a cup bait. Probably a Cuda. I watch. That's normally the way I roll. Kevin should start off hot. What in the hell did I hook? What in the f Give me the net. Give me the net. I'm you. I I'm gonna think it's a mess. <sighs> Somebody. Got her? That's a good one. Ooh, Dude, it ate a piece of cut pinfish. Alright guys, I just had a piece of cut pinfish down and just caught that nice hog. It's a beauty. Ate a slapped a cut piece of pinfish on a jig head. Trying for a grouper or a snapper and got a hogfish. Oh, so beautiful. Mwah. We're gonna get him in the cooler. He's gonna get a nice ah, da, 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 da. Three hogs in the box now. Yep. A couple grunt. Back to fishing. I can't believe I just caught a freaking goddamn hog on a cut chunk of pinfish. Not. I thought I had a mangrove. All right, guys, the bite kind of died off for us. We got three keeper hogs in the box, and Dustin pulled a couple small grouper, but I think we're going to send her out, try to get in that 70 to 80 foot range, see if we can't get on a better bite here. Bye. Think you'll keep? You got the net for him or? Oh, mine's not here. Right behind you. Ooh, nice red. 
Be close. He be close. My <laughs> Han? <laughs> Watch me. No, it doesn't look crazy big. Watch you be a lane. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I'm done with you. Uh, all right, guys. Kevin just dropped down. What'd you drop down? Uh, sardine. Sardine, and he got freight trained by a 21 inch red grouper. Look at that. He's adding to the box. We're going to be eating good tonight. He's pretty. In the box. Broke the streak, boys. Broke the streak. Boom. It's first keeper this year. I'm gonna try a butterfly pinfish. Yeah, we're just gonna have to slush it. He was mm, a little upset. We'll just put it that way. I was a lot upset. Probably cooler than have an indentation on it. No, it was weird. Yeah, it's coming up. I don't know. It was just different. <laughs> Honestly, I was like, I don't give a shit if it's a shark. Oh, watch out! Watch out! I think you're gonna need to. He's pretty hooked pretty deep. Oh, he's probably not gonna be a keeper. It's a gag. Uh, it? Yep. He's gonna be short. Yeah. Dang it. He freaking right Good lord. Oh, nice gagger. Nice gagger. I'm gonna measure him, but I don't think he's gonna be a keeper. Keep it. Just 24. Put him in the box. All right, guys. So that gag I thought wasn't going to be keeper ended up being keeper. He's just a smidge over 24, but he's a keeper. So we're going to put him in the box, and uh, we're going to drop on some more baits. They are pounding cut baits right now. <gasps> okay, guys. Last time I did this, the gag went skyrocketing out. And he's in the box! And he's in the box! Boom! So, we're gonna get back to fishing. I'm gonna have to slush the cooler here in a minute, but we're getting a pretty good pile of fish, guys. And it's still only like not even noon yet, so we're gonna see what else we can make happen. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we pulled up to a, a spot and I was reading a lot of false bottom, which usually false bottom means something off the bottom, and I was reading it as it was hard bottom. So, <clears throat> I'm like, alright, guys, let's just fire down some shrimp. And we fired down some shrimp. And Brandon pulled a uh, yellowtail snapper. I'm like, oh, that's good bottom. Then Kevin pulls a small hogfish. I'm like, we're anchoring. We anchor down, and I put out a butterfly. I don't remember what I put down. Butterfly something. It was a cut bait. And this 27-inch gag slurped it up. I mean, this is a pretty good day right here. This is number four grouper in the box, two reds, and two gags. You definitely can't complain. We're definitely going to keep fishing for a few more hours. See if we can't put some more in the box. Mwah. Yep, I gotta slush it. Back to fishing, boys. We hooked something on a butterfly grunt. I don't know what it is. Could be a Nerf shark. Could be a big grouper. That ain't no damn Nerf That's shark. a big grouper. You got big. your neck, Kevin? Uh, what is happening? What is happening? I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> Big grouper, boys. Oh, look at the net, Kevin. The net. Yo! <laughs> Big old red grouper. Big red grouper. Good. Hello, beautiful. Oh, Big old red grouper. He swallowed her. Where are those players at? Little cheatage. Little cheatage. 
All right, guys. So I had a. Don't fall overboard. I had a cut butterflied out uh, grunt on there. And Brandon's like, ah, that rod got hit a little while ago, but the rod didn't bow, it didn't nothing. He just inhaled it and then just sat. And I'm like, man, we're not doing crap. Let's pack up and move. We went to reel that rod up and not the big gag that we wanted, but it's a big red grouper, I'll take it. We're gonna put him in a box and decide if we're gonna drop down more cut baits or not. We'll find out. It goes in and it stays shut. Oop, knife. Oop, hands are caught. All right, so we were gonna leave here, but Dustin just pulled that nice red grouper. So we just dropped down another butterfly bait here and see if we can't pop another one. We're on, we're on, we're on. Brandon, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, here we go. Here's another rod holder. I'm letting Rodney help me out. Oh, she's dumping. Here's another rod holder, he's gonna bust that rod. That's a shark. If it's not, if that's not a shark, that's a huge grouper. Big camera to pull off. It's a grouper. It's a grouper. Oh, it's a monster. It's a big grouper. It's a monster. It's a big grouper. Is that Brandon? <laughs> it's a big grouper. Oh, man, look at this grouper. It's huge. No, that's oh, not a grouper. That's a, that's a snapper. That's a red snapper. That's a red snapper, dude. Wow. No way. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's out of season though. <laughs> oh my god, don't put him over. God. Ooh, hey. Oh my god. Nice fish. Whoa. Hey. How far out of season? <laughs> Way the fuck out of season. <laughs> oh my good golly. Bro, this is the biggest one. I haven't seen one this big on a boat. <sighs> Players on top of the yeah, there you go. Never mind, got it. Okay. Oh, there we go, we got him. Just dropped down that, what was that, spot tail? Yep. Freaking cut up spot tail down, and this huge American red just came and smashed him. This is my first one. This thing is an absolute freaking stud. They're out of season, so unfortunately we can't keep them, but... That was an epic fight right there, man. That was just absolutely sick. So we're gonna send him back and we're gonna keep getting after it. That thing fought like a freaking train, boy. <laughs> I was waiting for you. I told him to shut up so you could go. <laughs> All right, guys. So today was definitely a very productive day. We uh, we tried to get some Goliaths towards the end of the day, but it didn't really work out to our advantage. Um, we definitely pulled a decent box. It was a good day, without a doubt. So if you guys liked the video, hit the subscribe button. Give us a like. We'll see you guys next time. Did that just hit you in the head? Did you get cracked in the head with the weight? Did you get beaten? Oh. <laughs> Are you okay?